Hi, everybody. This is take two, because the first one was blurry, so I get to do this all over again. Aha. So my name is Rachel. For those of you who don't know me, I live in Brigham City, Utah. And normally, I am down in Salt Lake County hanging out with Heron in the gang. But because of COVID, staying up here so I'm filming at my house here and I have a wonky immune system so I'm just kind of trying to stay away from people for a while <laughs> and today we're going to do a guided meditation for some stress relief from the body so if you would like to light a candle or get some incense go ahead and grab that I'm pre-recording this because I've been coughing and I don't want to cough in your ear during meditation. So I'll be drinking water and pushing pause and editing. So you might see some jump cuts, but I, I'm, I'm not COVID positive. I've been tested. We're good. So I'm filming on Zoom and it will let me Pause if I feel a cough coming on. We will be doing online stuff for the foreseeable future. So if you have a wish list of topics you would like us to talk about, please feel free to let us know in the comments. When we have met in person in the past, we've done divination gatherings where we brought tarot cards and runes and such. And we've practiced giving readings to each other and just learning about different decks. We've also done new moon dinner and discussions where I have potlucks and um, we took turns talking about different topics. So if we wanted to do a, a virtual divination night or a dinner and discussion, we could do that. And if you've never used zoom it just puts us in little brady bunch squares on the screen so we can see each other so it's a free software that you would download and you can do that on your phone or on your laptop and then i would email you a link to access the zoom room and i would email the link rather than posting it on social media so we don't have some sketchy people showing up and then it would be password protected for our privacy and safety. So doing that might allow us more options for ritual participation and to make it more interactive rather than just me talking to a camera. And I miss everybody. I want to see your pretty faces. So I'm offering to do this because it could be quite some time before we're able to meet in person again. And I know that this extended social distancing is taking a toll on a lot of people's mental health, especially for people who live alone. My colleagues and I are noticing a lot more depression and anxiety. Physical contact and visiting friends boost our immune system and our mood. But ironically, those are the things that put us at risk for COVID. So if anyone wants to gather virtually, I'm offering that platform. Just post it in the comments if that's something you would like me to arrange, and I'd be happy to facilitate that. So I had been pondering what to talk about today. And when I turned my camera on yesterday to film, I just sat there and stared at it, and my mind drew a blank, and eventually I broke down crying partly because I miss you guys and I miss the temple, the yurt, with the sights and the sounds and the smells. Um, you know, when you, when you light the incense, that, that smell. You know that smell? It tells my brain to relax. And it gets me in a certain type of mood. 
So attending the circle every month is something that I find very relaxing and uplifting and it brings me a lot of peace. So since it could be a while before everything is back to normal, you might like to create a sacred space in your home if you don't already have one. So when I like this incense, um, when I'm taking the time to do that, it does help me relax and I can leave everything outside the circle and just focus on my spiritual practice. So yesterday when I broke down crying, I realized it was because I had nothing to say. I had nothing to offer because my spiritual well was dry. I hadn't done my self care and I had hardly been to my altar since COVID started. And then there was the financial crisis and then the protests. So all these things are going on in the news and they're weighing heavily on my mind and I wasn't processing it. I wasn't releasing it. And I realized I couldn't give from an empty well. We only have so many units of attention that we can give to things during a day. And we can only take so much for so long and stress really takes a toll on our body. So, Today, I would like to invite you to join me in a guided meditation to bring awareness to the sensations in the body and to release any tension that you may feel. And I will aim the camera at the Wellsville mountain range so you can look at the mountains. Close your eyes, whatever feels good to you. Okay. Hmm. Looks like it's going to be blurry anyway. Huh? Yes, we get what we get. Oh. That, that, that is a Christmas tree. Kind of a pine tree. There it is. I'm going to try to hide. <laughs> I'm so sorry, it's blurry. Oh well, appreciate your patience. So I'll go figure out our, figure out all of our tech. Let's start by getting into a comfortable position. If you like, you can close your eyes, or you can look at the blurry mountains up there. Watch the sunset. Now notice your breath. Feel your chest rise and fall. Feel the air move through your nose and mouth. Your body knows how to breathe in a smooth, deep rhythm that's perfect for you. There's nothing you need to do, just feel your body breathing. As you breathe, notice how your eyes feel. Imagine that you can feel the tiny muscles within your eyes that focus your vision close up or far away.
as you picture these muscles, let them relax. Notice how your eyes feel as these muscles become soft and loose. As you continue breathing smoothly and easily, let your attention drift to the bigger muscles that move your eyes right and left, up and down. Let your eyes rest comfortably in their sockets, quiet and still. As you breathe, let your awareness move to the muscles that surround your eyes. Notice the sensations in the small muscles below your eyes, in your eyelids, and around your eyebrows. And as you do, let these muscles relax completely. Feel the skin around your eyes become smooth and calm as all of those muscles release. Take a nice, slow breath. And enjoy the feeling of comfort and relaxation around your eyes. As the space between your eyes becomes smooth and soft, notice how the muscles of your nose begin to relax. And as you breathe out, let this deep relaxation spread from your nose and eyes up through your forehead. Feel it move like a soft wave through your scalp, like gentle ripples all the way to the base of your skull, releasing any tension. With your next breath, let your attention move to your tongue. Notice how it feels and where it lies in your mouth. Since you're not using your tongue right now, it can relax. Let it rest on the floor of your mouth, becoming soft and quiet. A 
allow your jaw to loosen just enough to create a little space between your tongue and the roof, roof of your mouth. With each breath, your tongue feels more supple, more relaxed. And take another slow, deep breath. Letting that deep relaxation spread through your lips and your cheeks and your ears. Let this soft, smooth feeling release through all the muscles in your jaw, your neck, then your throat. As you breathe, allow the gentle wave to flow into your shoulders. And feel your neck lengthen as your shoulders relax down and back into their natural position. Let yourself be completely aware of how your body feels. As these muscles become loose and comfortable. Now let your attention move smoothly and easily to your elbows. Just notice whether your elbows are resting on something or whether they are bent or straight. And sense whether they are supporting part of your weight. And if so, gently shift the position of your arms to release that weight. All the muscles of your arms come together here, so as you focus on your elbows, allow everything around them to relax. Let the entire elbow joint become loose and comfortable, free to move easily and smoothly. With each breath, observe as the sensation radiates out from your elbows through your arms, moving down through your forearms, your wrists, your hands, all the way to your fingertips. Every muscle returns to its natural state of healthy relaxation. This piece flows from your elbows, through your upper arms, and through your shoulders. And as it does, each muscle, large and small, just lets go. Tension simply evaporates as all these muscles settle into a state of total comfort. Your arms and shoulders are completely relaxed now.
take a moment to return your attention to your eyes. You may have found that some of those muscles have tightened up a bit. If so, just breathe and let them relax once again. Feeling the calm through your nose, your forehead, and your scalp. Observe your tongue again and let those muscles relax even more deeply, sending a soothing wave into your jaw, your neck, your throat, and your shoulders. Now as you breathe in, let your awareness drift downward through your body to a point just below your navel. Here in the body's resting center of gravity, powerful muscles are constantly working to maintain your posture and other essential functions. Tell them it's time to relax. Feel the sensations in your core as all of these muscles loosen and soften. Notice how easy it is to take a deeper breath now, letting your center expand as you inhale. Let this relaxation radiate through the core of your body. As the muscles of your chest and upper back become soft and loose, they align and merge perfectly with your deeply relaxed shoulders and arms. As the muscles relax down through your lower back and pelvis, every part of your torso settles easily into its comfortable, natural state. And take another deep breath. And as you do, check back in with your eyes. And let them relax again. and check back with your jaw. And your elbows. As you breathe, shift your attention to your knees and notice how they feel. Focus on the sensations. Becoming aware of any stiffness or tension here in the connecting point for your leg muscles. Allow your knees to relax smoothly and completely. Once again, you can feel that 
relaxation, spreading down through your legs, down through your calves, your ankles, your feet, all the way to your toes. Deep wave of release moves up from your knees, through your thighs and hips. All those muscles, large and small, lengthen and loosen as they unwind. Check back in with your face. And relax your muscles and your neck. Relax your arms. Relax your belly. And your back. From the top of your head to the tips of your fingers and toes, your body is in a state of calm, natural well-being. It's easy to evaporate stress and restore well-being anytime just by checking and relaxing different points in the body throughout the day. Even in a tense meeting or rush hour traffic, you can use a light version of this process to stay calm and comfortable. Keeping your eyes open. <laughs> Simply focus on a point and relax the muscles in that area that aren't needed to maintain your posture. And you might be surprised how many muscles are holding tension even though you're not using them. Check in once more with each spot now, with your eyes open if you wish. Gently shift your body side to side and stretch any remaining points of tension. Notice the sounds around you. And the sounds around me, if you can hear them. And the sensations in your body. You've learned to transform stress into comfortable relaxation. And you can do this anytime, if you'd like. Enjoy the rest of your day. Namaste.